Ground teams, this is Control. Need a sit rep from the Garment District. This is Armored Patrol reporting in. No sign of the target. The Daily Bugle. Always a great paper. Even more now that Jameson's retired. MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process this stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. it went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Like a bug on a windshield. Splat. All because he may want... I heard that! 
need to distract him. Hacking app should work. Who's there? Okay, that did it. Uh, must have imagined it. This place is creaky. Should be able to hop that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. You two, Guys, get over here! Iodine, but no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. All right, all right, all right. Fine. Some hearing things. Up right now. Just give us the locations and schedules for supply points. More supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. I don't have that information. Believe me, I hate watching Benson wait on Turns my stomach. Just give us the info and we'll stop. Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these relief centers? Something about Osborne. They want to show how weak he is, that he can't protect the city. <laughs> As long as they let us keep all the supplies we find, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on. Let's keep digging through it. Sable guys give up the depot locations? Eventually, yeah. Now the big guy's taking the stations out all by himself. Dudes are walking a bomb. Another supply tent. Oh, crap. A couple trauma kits. But no antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Looks like they're gonna divvy up the supplies. Got to avoid that sniper. Hey. Bro, relax. Dick. Please try to shoot. I heard that. Dude, please don't. I heard that. More supplies. Exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedules. Now! Yes, Kazal! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is. inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! <gasps> Not need to see that. What was that? Check it. Now. Don't think he saw me. Time to get out of here. Ford is 
right past him. You have my patience. Ah! So let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. 
We'll get through this. Keep the faith. down by snipers. Incident was reported near Sugar Hill. Over. Escaped convict with sniper rifle. Okay, back to Sneaky Spider. Why Jonah paid me the big bucks. Captain, these Sable guys look like they forced all the residents out of a building so they could occupy it themselves. And locked up the ones who objected. Okay, that I can get something done about. But I need victims to come forward. I'll get the people out and have them file reports with the police. We're the ones out here risking our lives. You think they'd be glad to let us use their crappy unimpartial visual? Seriously. <laughs>
party! shelters are on the street. I know what it's like not to have anywhere to stay. It's a good thing these Sable agents have body armor, because I just might lose my temper. Took longer than it should have.
Captain, the people that were locked up are headed back to their homes. Good. And I finally convinced the mayor's office that making constituents homeless was not good for his poll numbers, so they won't be pulling that stunt again. Wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Sports, love you, but you do know it's just to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Jonathan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. You are in my way! So you guys and Octavius, huh? You have a name yet? The scary sister and a dirty half dozen. How about it? We murdered Spider-Man and used his corpse for a blanket today. Jargon, please! You embarrass yourself! Jargon, what are you doing? Play him, Harry! Get him, you idiot! Get him! Stop upsetting, Jargon! I will squash both myself! We could just stop now, you know. I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! Rhino's done. For fist of fury. Come here, out. I will teach you to throw real punch. My jaws already absorbed that particular lesson. Thanks. Didn't I hear you took a poetry class in the raft? Like a therapy thing? Now, here is late. Along came Spider. I sat down beside him, then crushed his tiny body to bear. That's so good! Do you know 
know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed! I failed? Yes, you, freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. All units, reports of shots fired and officers down. Backup needs... Alarmist. Paranoid. Conspiracy theories. All nasty words people have used to insult and demean me. But now, after years of me trying to warn you all, here we are. Spider-Man has literally brought a plague down upon us. Why do I blame him and not Martin Lee? I do blame Martin Lee. He deserves swift justice, but he's a lunatic terrorist. This is what they do. Whereas Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Yet he obviously knew about the threat and didn't warn us. He either thought he'd handled it, which makes him criminally negligent. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs! Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague! Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back up. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. That should do it. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Get out here right now. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished Off their limits, sweep. ma'am. Need to go around. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. More like Osborne's safety. Please, everyone, please remain calm. Just don't see why you guys need to be back. Hello. Because you run a cops I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Sector clear. Continue. <laughs> I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. What was 
that. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's co elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm tape. Stupid useless button. Mm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on... Ex MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? Wonder where it leads. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. The fabulous Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Combat prototype from the schematic.
Looks like a boatload of electrical is routed right behind that painting of Norman. Schematic for the prototype mask. Norman seems to be pushing Oscorp towards defense work. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry all Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Happy birthday, dear. Sorry I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... 
have sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, M. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. For Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location.
Continuing sweep. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? scientist thing going on. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's commercial building. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum in a shopping center. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. Bravo, bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. God, I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti serum is, he must have been too. Good old Alpha Team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? 